Off Gary Wilson, 13-7 last night. This is the proper stuff, Joe. If you're not, if you're not looking forward to this one, eh? Hit us. You can expect a tough, tough battle. And when the player gets in, they'll expect to make the most of it. Yeah, pointed in 546 to just seven. It's impossible, isn't it? But he did it. Gonna get the speed right here. And that wasn't the worth playing the double, I can tell you. Yeah, good shot. Decided to go into them. Competition, actually, you know, when it goes down to one table, all of a sudden it's well. thirty-five. Shorter pace that time. Needs to slow down. It needs to slow down. Bulls. And it dropped. Surely not. Just needs to finish a half ball on the black. So you can just... One. Just got to finish on the black. Nine. Played a lovely little cannon off the red there. Should have been his. 42. I think it's because of all the talk about the pockets being big, but you know, 45. as you say, where it caught the cushion, it was round to blue. So easy to get this wrong. 49. <laughs> Well, I know a lot of people pre-match. 60. And that is exactly what has happened. So, score's tied. If he plays this shot that they normally play nowadays. Wow, that 
slipped in. <laughs> it certainly did. Oh, wow. I'm thin cut. No attempt. Just played the safety, of which is a very good one. Doesn't want it to drift. And it drifted and got. Both players have had a chance at this black. Don't leave a double. I think he played it a little harder than that cue ball would have gone in. Needs to slow down. <laughs> Didn't fancy it. Higgins on the other hand. Oh, that's brilliant. What a great pot from John Higgins. It's Higgins' 90th match here. That's level now with Stephen Higgins. Another good long pot. One. Always nice to see a frame. Um. He nearly overcut it. That's a great Seven. shot. Didn't go according to plan. I thought it was in for a moment. Can off early. I'm supposed to play two more. Just to give them time between sessions. I'm sure Selby would have loved to have carried on. Who knows what could have happened if they if he had. From where he was, that's an excellent return to safety. Look at that. He's found the gap as well. That's a mistake. Now, oh, how costly. Four. He's missed a, a few with the rest okay. recently, but these balls that is a t would come into play here. Oh. 
everyone. Five. It's only lost five frames so far in the tournament. Beat David 11. Grace 10 3. And of course. Yeah, that would be something. Seventeen. Twenty-five. Thirty-one. It's another red. Just push the blue safe and the brown, <laughs> just in case. Was that unable to play? <laughs> yeah, another great pot, and that surely secures the frame for John Higgins, who's made a good start here. Furtherden. There's a long way to go, clearly, but. Higgins fourth and a frame. Selby took on in frame one the respotted black from distance to oh. this pop. Covering the red to the right middle with the brown. <coughs> Just got to play the shots as you see them. He knows all the scenarios. Yes, and he also knows that Higgins knows he knows all. I do think this quarter final is unlike the other three. It never goes according to plan. You can pick out all safety play now. Red's coming back down this end of the table. Well, he's done it. And they do with it, of course, he's already 2 0 up. So feeling good in general. Oh, what a. Fine. A few finals, but. Here at the Crucible, frankly, he's looking as good as ever. 
you know, and, and he's not had a good campaign, but he's found something for sure. Got them perfect. Left him straight on the red to the middle. Well, certainly if he wins a fifth one. The point is that he's playing good five. snooker at the moment. His standards. Thirty-five. Just over. <laughs> Did in the end break down just four, and has not really had a look in since. pocket 56 Same pocket. And that's what he's played. Great pot. Eight. Played confidently, trying to finish low. That's too massive. This could be good if it misses the green. Bounces. He's got him. He likes to play these a two cushion way. And he's done well. He's done very well. Him 
It's only the pace he got the line. Dangerous. Here it goes. We'll be relieved. It's definitely true. He's also 91% pot success. So although he did miss the black initially and 126 of them. Five. We don't. A couple of these frames, of course, have been closely contested. Eight. Mark Selby is 12. He's so good at bossing matches and controlling the way they're played, but it's hard to do that against 17. someone like John Higgins. Who leads? Selby. And he left the left red, last red on over the middle. That's so unlike him. spot the last frame as well and ultimately let's come up with nothing in terms of a frame on the board it's easy to say he's gonna to have to score in this match but first he always turns into a prolonged battle maybe not this frame that's a well he could miss the reds One. And he's going to be on one. It's not. Nice little Seven. rub. No. Think he can. Lots of top spin. Right hand side. Is it hard enough? <laughs> yeah, he didn't play to hit the black. Hello. Maxwell eleven. Didn't intend to catch that bump, Keep but. Quiet, please. Open the reds up nicely. Oh, what a big shot. Oh, what a great shot. One. You have to hit them so accurately to miss all the reds. If you miss the pot, you. Mark Silver won. the frame off at that visit but he's shown a bit more fluency of the two well that red going towards the corner well that wasn't far away and he's got that cue ball into a pretty good yeah terrific opening pot Terrific.
four. As, as he was potting the winning balls. If he's in the final again, of course, his children will be here, I'm Nine. sure, and his wife. Maybe he'd have played the One. snooker. This is actually one of the best scoring chances he's had. Eight. Fifteen. Yeah, one of his great strengths, nil, in a best of twenty-five. Twenty-two. He didn't get in the jaws. I think he was thinking more. Yeah, it's been very 29. interesting, and, and the green alone to Selby, who now needs this red to win his first frame. The respot in frame one. And now it looks like Mark Selby is on Texas. the scoreboard. Just one snook at the moment. Just thinking all that. Four to three. Well, that things as they go for their cup of tea. And these first four frames have been, as I say, hard fought. 50. You'd expect nothing less from these two great. Fifty-eight. Very exciting round. It's played over just two days. So other than the final, it's actually the shortest amount of time for a round at 61. the Crucible. Position where the match is still winnable on day two. Sixty-five. So we've got four more frames to coon. Break of the match from either player. Okay. 70. One lead over Mark Selby. It was 3 0. Selby made a 70 break to win the pre interval frame. It's another four to come here this afternoon, but this match doesn't conclude until tomorrow night. Come up and just a little bit too thin, and that's why they. Yes, and they're nice ladies up. Pink, not a. Seven. <laughs> John Higgins landed in the circle in that last frame, but didn't pop the green. Eleven. Uh, I'm not sure we ran for the blue. Didn't catch it full enough. Four. Yeah, too high. Yes, I mentioned in the last frames of himself, O'Sullivan and Mark Williams, the class of 92. Nine. And long may it continue because they play snooker in all as as aspects of the game. Great building. The black that he missed, yes, you would expect him to pot it. It was tough. Six. 
33. Way down at that age. But we've seen the incredible longevity that... Forty-seven. There's one of them. Fifty-five. And eventually. So drop it in. Leave his opponent needing snookers. Selby didn't take his chance. Higgins has stepped in Seven and now one. has an opportunity to make his seventh century of this. And when we hear people say, they don't say, a mark still there, still stopping people. 76. A generation that. Ah, well. Got to be something. 79, though, will do. It's a winning break. It's come from the Selby era. Just delighted to get that cue ball back into the box area and not leave a red over the box spot. Got to avoid the blue. Yeah, good pot. Nicely controlled. Do it from there this time round. He's gone for it. And he's nicely on it. Six. And yeah, it could just hold for them using the pink. He is, can't do anything from his seat. It's up to Selby to try and do damage when he's at the table. 21. That's what he couldn't do in that match. This in that red near the black. Twenty-seven. In terms of a hundred plus, because O'Sullivan's made over two hundred. 35. Slightly awkward, but should be able to stun up for this red. No. Four to three. What he's played. <coughs> well, I go back to the red that he fluked. He didn't finish ideal on that red, did he? From an easy black off the. 
Just got to keep that cue ball under control, which he normally does. Six to two. At the moment. Break ends at 70. To, to come down a little if there were more breaks made. Such a difficult shot to play. Digging down into the cue ball. He needs a bit of luck. And he didn't get it. He's ready. One. So Nine. We saw though down, but then after the interval in that second session, he won all four frames. Seventy. Twenty-five. <laughs> At that. Surely he's on one and he's on one pair. Yes, at one visit Thanks. as well. But he's still got to do it. Yes, and 4-4 four, four could make. Could have been 5-1. It was 4-2. And here. Great recovery. Six to seven. Terrific with this break. And it's been excellent. And there's only one in it now. Higgins was good value for the lead he had. But it's been... Left a chance. One. Well, he couldn't have played. Seven. Yeah. into the pack, pink full in the face. Now, oh, great recovery. 13. Really good. At Max over 16. I'm progressing somehow. And that is not going to help his cause. He's missed think, running through off two cushions. One. Pink back on it, but it just seems likely to be close. We'll see. Yeah, don't forget we want to see the pain. Particularly if that last shot of Higgins Eight. is his. Well, it was a good pot, but he couldn't hold the cue ball. Was at any point. 
he loses position or if he's behind in a match, that's when he digs in. 15. 21. Their safety. His position on play is a lot better. 28. And digging himself out of a, an early hole in this match from 4 1 down. The fluke 35. was big, though. I think Higgins will look back at that sixth frame because he wasn't forced to win it the next session. 42. Yes, and this is where experience. He looked good. It's set up nicely this match, as we hoped it would be for two more fascinating. Well, Radzi in our studio last night described this as granite v granite, and he was absolutely right. As each, they got everything you want in terms of a game. John Higgins made the early running in them when they come back on Wednesday for the final day. Seventy. And then bot it to potentially end the afternoon with one. Yeah, good shot. Gonna have to really power this one in. This was in control. And the brakes have also come. We saw a fluke that was key. We've seen... Ninety-two. And we could be about to see... He's ending the afternoon. Well, he was in a hole, but once again, Mark, 70, 82, and that 103, first session of this...